All right, Bailey B works at an old theater that is set to be haunted. Although Bailey loves his job, there's mm. something about it he there's wishes he could change. Exist. That looks old. He often fuck. works at night, and he doesn't like this. For some reason, whenever Bailey's on stage, he can't help but feel like there's someone there. It almost feels like there's someone watching him. Well, that's just stage anxiety, bro. <laughs> I feel it's like. for this reason that he often records while working. But then one night, Bailey receives a notification that a sensor has detected motion inside the theater. Bailey writes, oh, This is the scariest thing that has ever happened to me. I might quit. This is what he captured. if I were you, I would have it's, all of the uh, lights turned on. Fuck the electrical bill, that's not my problem, bro. <laughs> this is my life. So I'm walking through the main stage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Here, I'll flip it. Okay. Set to backstage. Ghost light is on. No one in here. Hello. Okay. Imagine the balcony. See that thing in the middle? Oh, oh, it's two people, dude. Oh, holy shit, that's not, that's two fucking people. What the fuck? Just keep staring at them, bro. Don't, don't you. <gasps> that is fucked. Bailey was in total shock oh, and was trying to process bitch. what he'd seen. Now, it could be that Dude, someone I'd had broken in and too. decided to seat themselves on the balcony. But given the history of this place, which has had numerous paranormal occurrences, Bailey can't shake the thought of this being a ghostly encounter. But if anything, Bailey can rest assured that he isn't losing his mind, as what he captured on camera shows that someone or something was actually watching him. Bro, but the thing is, you kind of that. Show me the full video. What happens when he finally st gets the fucking courage to start moving again, huh? What happens then? It's fake as fuck, bro. <laughs> a father takes his wife and child to a theme park, and while recording them, captures something pretty creepy. The father states no, that after know. coming back from the theme park, his daughter told him that she was scared of going video. back. No, 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 no. But what? it wasn't because she was afraid of the rides, but because of something else. It was only after looking back at the footage he captured that he understood why his daughter was so afraid. This is what he caught. Be sure to look closely or you'll miss it. What kind of fucked up things can be at a theme park, dude? I think I'm she was the only one to notice it at a public area. Huh? Right but, behind what? his daughter, there appears to be a right hand coming daughter. out of nowhere. Oh shit. Oh. What the fuck? Bro, that's straight up a horror movie effect, bro. The scariest. I'm sorry. Yeah, I don't believe that. I don't believe that. I believe ghosts moving shit, without anybody being there. But a hand and like scary creatures like having part physical about bodies, this that though, I don't believe. Is the fact so that, that it right seems there, to be I reaching out to her. It. But as if that, that wasn't creepy mimicked. enough, something else was caught on camera that also went unnoticed. Oh, Earlier in the video, oh, never the father is recording <laughs> a boat that's passing by. When out of nowhere, Motherfucker. he captures Three, two, this. One. Fuck you. Alright, you picked my interest. What the fuck is this? Whoa. <laughs> Yo. Aw, oh, hell no, bro. It's fucking you. Bro. Get the fuck out of here. Lost interest already. It's gonna be another hand gripping out. Maybe a girl. Maybe a ghost lady looking at him. I'm looking at every other corner. It's usually in the corners when the fucking thing appears. But I don't see shit. Ah, oh, fuck off. What's over there?
Really, bro? Dude, uh, 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 that's a fucking leaf. That's a fucking leaf right there, dude. Those are leaves. Those are fucking. That's a fucking leaf. Every leaf is like individual strands, so it's no shit. That's not a hand, bro. That's just leaves. That every, every, it's a fucking strand. Dude. And then the thing up that makes it look like a face. That's just another leaf, bro. Fuck off. Oh shit. But maybe never mind. What the fuck was that? Wait, it did. It did a weird ass movement. Yeah, what the fuck? You know what? I honestly have no explanation for this, but I have plenty of questions. I can't help but think that this might have been the same hand that appears later on. But what's even more creepy about this nah, is that it the looks like it's trying to get leaf. the father's attention. Or could it be that it was trying to get the daughter's? There has yet to be an explanation for this, but as always, what are your thoughts? My thoughts are that they are leaves, but it's nature calling. A dog and her owner are both home alone when the following happens. Oh, shit. The owner who posted the video writes, Hazel has been growling for 10 minutes. I checked the security cameras to see if someone was outside, but there wasn't. So I decided to record her as this is not her like normal I said, behavior. I've said this before, my dogs bark at nothing like all the fucking time. And nothing bad happens. You in the name of Jesus Christ, you must leave. Oh, fuck off. That's just gonna piss the ghost mo even, even more. Oh, <laughs> and the dog. Oh shit. What, is it, what the fuck? Mm. I told you, bro. Don't fucking challenge what the is ghost. Hazel seeing? Christ, man. And what might be the off. reason as to why she's growling? It's believed that dogs can see things such as entities that we can't. Yeah. But I'll also let you babies. decide as to whether what or not she's fuck? actually seeing something. Let me know what you think. Mm. If you caught something creepy on camera to scare it back bro, to the video, a user by the I name haven't. of the Annoying Bird 88 <laughs> has caught something creepy on camera. Annoying Bird states that the activity in her home has been getting worse. And in a recent video she posted, it's obvious that something strange is going on. Annoying Bird writes, Last night's video, just watch and listen to the stairs. Oh shit, we're gonna be hearing footsteps, and, but nothing's there. Because that what scares me the most. It's so creepy. I'm looking at the stairs, bro. Each single step, I'm looking at them. Analyzing. Oh, oh shit, look at the orb, look at the orb, at the orb. Did you see that motherfucking orb, bro? As with most videos on the paranormal, it's hard to tell if it's fake or not. A sound effect of someone walking down the stairs could have easily That's been true. added to the footage to make it seem like it was but a ghost. Explain the orb, bro. But Annoying Bird proves that it's real by recording yourself going down the stairs to show that the sound in the video is actually from her own. Bro, why the fuck does your stare squeak that much, huh? She has yet to post more footage of the strange occurrence, so stay tuned. Number two. Perfect. The following right. video was submitted without any context or background information. With or without it though, it's still pretty creepy. The video shows a girl singing along to a song when something creepy happens There's in no the background. There's no description or backstory Take behind it. It's fucking fake. It's fake. Watch it. Watch it be fake as fuck. Oh my fucking god. What the fuck? Dude, you should be rec if you're recording yourself, you should be able to see what the fuck is behind you. What do you make of this video? Real or fake? Let it's me know fake. what you think. It's fucking. Oh, fuck off. Three, two, one, you fake ass bitch. High quality story driven content is possible with stock footage. Check out our grid.io. My name is Aya and I'm a film. Shut the fuck up. I'm not using any of that on my videos. <laughs> well, first of all, on this one, it's fucking fake. The bitch is doing a TikTok, right? And creepy happens in the background. Make it, wait. Take a look. She's doing a TikTok dance, bro. Look at that. Look at that. She's recording herself, right? If you're recording yourself, you can see what's behind you, bitch. Unless you're an 
idiot who like fucking records with the back cam instead of the front. But if you're recording with the front cam, you should be able to see yourself and therefore see what's behind you. But if you don't fucking react to what's fucking behind you right there, fucking going for it. And I think he also, that thing also reaches its hand out. Dumb hospital bitch, like in Warren, <laughs> Ohio and encounters something very strange. The hospital has been abandoned for more than 10 years and is currently in the process of being demolished. Knowing this, Christopher decides to explore the building before it's torn down. But little does he know that deep within the hospital, an ominous presence seems to be hiding inside. That is scary. Christopher enters the premises of the building and doesn't encounter anything that unusual. That don't even look like a hospital. But when he arrives at a passageway down. located far inside the hospital, Christopher think, encounters no something pretty either. creepy. <laughs> Take the a look. Got no paint. It's all fucking pitch black, bro. You walk in there, you don't see a fucking hospital. You don't see an abandoned hospital. You see something else. Ooh, a hand. That's not scary. As much. It's a hand. Dude, that shit's fucked, bro. You would never catch me going there by myself. Not even with two, fr two friends or three. You would have to be like a whole fuck. It appears that Christopher isn't like aware gang. of the shadowy figure <laughs> by the door. It was only after viewers had. We have to be a group of ten, and each of us carrying guns. That's the only that way he I'm noticed. That. Now it could be the case that this was someone who was squatting, but upon a closer examination, it doesn't seem like this might have been a squatter. Nor does it look like this might have been a person. Christopher continues to explore further ahead, still like unaware of what he had caught on camera. Black. He arrives at a room that's completely torn down, but there's something about this room that's unsettling. There's something ominous in the air, and Chris is well aware of it. Then, just when things couldn't get any more creepy, this happens. Mm. It's gonna be a noise, it's gonna be a loud noise. Maybe that will scare this guy off to run away. <laughs> to be smart, fucking run away. Holy shit. And what do you do? You zoom in, bro. Fuck off. <laughs> Get out of there. Do it again, ghost. Alright, now he's sleeping. <laughs> I'm going to a different room. That's not the exit, bro. You're in the Bronx. Spot. What the fuck? This is so eerie. Christopher isn't sure as to what was hiding inside the hospital. And Christopher's still being a Whatever it was, just walking. he can at least take comfort in the thought that he won't <sighs> be seeing it ever again, as the building will soon be demolished. But <laughs> as always, that. That what are your thoughts? Explode. Ghost or something else? Thanks for watching. And Thanks I for watching, and I hope you enjoyed the videos. Follow me more for more Burger King for that ass.